In the autumn, the meadows beside the Killian Mountains turn yellow. Times of hardship are coming along, but not for the Tibetan gazelles. With winter approaching, they sound their rallying call to move into the heart of the grassland in search of food. There was a time when Tibetan gazelles were found only on the Qinghe Tibet Plateau. Nobody knows when the first of them became aware of how suitable was the environment of the Kilian Mountains and decided to migrate. Where the Kilian Mountains skirt the northern edge of the King He Tibet Plateau, the melting snow nourishes the alpine meadow. The Tibetan gazelle is a hoofed creature with a small frame and great energy. The vast grassland offers plenty of space to run freely. And the woodland surrounding the meadow provides a safe haven to rest. The male gazelles, identified by their tapered horns, are on the alert, constantly surveying their surroundings. The sudden appearance of a wolf has scattered the herd. On the far side of the meadow, a lone mother assumes the responsibility for protecting her two young. They run towards the high ground, brightly lit by the sun. Although they may be exposed to predators here, they can also be easily spotted by the rest of the herd. The most prominent feature distinguishing Tibetan gazelles is their heart-shaped white rear patch. But rather than attracting a mate, this unique feature serves as a means of communication. Ultraviolet rays are fierce on the highlands. The heart-shaped patch on the gazelle's rear reflects the light. The stubby black tail set against the white sends a clear signal to other gazelles in the event of danger. The signal is working. Seeing the familiar white haunch, the father charges towards them. On the grassland, there's no other species that can outrun a Tibetan gazelle with a top speed of 80 kilometers per hour. A demonstration of grace and intimacy expresses their joy at being reunited. In the wilderness, where the strong prey on the weak, tragedy is a daily occurrence. Here at over 3,000 meters above sea level, the Tibetan gazelles are continuing their migration. From October to May, in order to gather sufficient food for the winter, the herds roam the meadows and valleys on a quest of hope and survival. For all living things on the grassland, finding food to eat in the winter cold is a matter of life and death. <laughs>